guys, it's Fluffy Photos and a lot of humongous updates. First off, I got this 2.5 gallon and I had it all set up with a little crab for about two days and then the crab died. So I had this empty 2.5 gallon tank that I'm moving this beta into and I gotta clean it up, clean this one all out and clean this all out. So this will be the beta's new tank and this will be like an update like rescue tank or extra tank just in case anything happens. So yeah, this one is going to be for the beta. Um, so that's the first update. The second update is you're probably wondering why I have all these hamster products. And it's because I did get a hamster about like three weeks ago. I've been so busy not being able to film a video. So I have this toy hanging on the thing. And I'll do a cage tour another day, but um, I have, oops, sorry. Okay, so I have... This owl squishy thing, and then this, this is an air freshener, and I just have, like, the water bottle, the peanut thing, and food, and a toilet paper tube, and I'm just moving that out of here. So it's a boy, and it's a male robo north hamster, and it's probably in here. Yep. The lighting's, like, really off right now, but I'm still trying to tame him. So, yeah. so here she is. I don't want to blind him with the lighting. I don't want to blind him with the flash of my camera, but um, I'll have him out in better lighting and more. And I have him out in the bathtub to play, but yeah. So here he is, and I'll show you a couple of the things I have. So yesterday I went to the hamster ball derby for the hamster, but we also brought the sugar glider, and Hazel is my hamster's name. He did not move at all, but the sugar glider got second in their division. But we did not take home any overall place, but we still brought home some stickers. Some of which are already on his ball that I have to clean out. We have the information from the Hamster Ball der Derby and how to train your hamster for the next one. We also have some Hamster Ball Derby stickers. I'll put that up there. Also, I've got the Hamster Ball. And I put stickers on it, and it's really disgusting because i got to clean it out, but... He's been running in it all day. Um, this is just measuring cups that I use for my fish tank still. I put this up here. Fish food. There Sorry, the lighting's off. I have hamster food. And I was going to feed it hazel hamster, but this was just a better option for me. Um, I do have these snacks. I mean, you know, chew toys. And it's like tofu or something. And this is also... Um, uh, hamburger and about these scratches over here that's just from a cat just to let anyone know and then I do feed my hamster Gerber puffs as a treat these are all natural basically and they have no sugar or little sugar and then millet which I'm gonna give my hamster tonight and some more chew toys back there then at Petco yesterday I didn't film because it was crazy with the hamster derby um, I got, what's this, dust for dust baths, and I just have to get something to put the dust in. And also, this is what Hazel got from participating in the Hamster Ball Derby. And this is what Suki got, which is the same thing. And Suki is the sugar glider, which I will be having, like, so many more videos on all the pets and fish and everything. So, let me just put everything back. And in this bin, it was just some crap stuff that I had. Just basic sand and stuff. But I'm not sure, like I said, um, I think for now I'm just going to be cleaning out this guy's tank. This is Jimmy, by the way, and putting him in here. And then I can use this for, like, Mexican lobster, but I don't really want to because I want most of my animals, like, aquatics to have filters, except for the beta, but I need to clean him out, so I better get going. And let me just give you a quick update on the... 20 gallon and a very like bad story okay have. so here is my 20 gallon and you might be thinking to yourself oh wow it looks crystal clear yesterday i siphoned the tank because it was really dirty and gross and we found out that the filter wasn't running and the heater wasn't on the only thing that was on was the air bubbles i lost none of my fish or aquatics the only thing i lost was my adult snail but um other than that it's really good so i have Everything, I just added that plant. I got it from Walmart for a dollar. And I just have all of this. You see my guppy. And my plant. I just moved things around a bit. Um, so it looks like that. And then 
so many bubbles. What was I going to show you guys? I have that invisible catfish thingy. Still alive. And then a pleco in here. And they're doing great. And over here I just have some extra stuff. I took the mermaid out. Oh, it was getting kind of gross. So, there's a little food. And then extra tanks so I can get like another beta if I wanted to. Like I can have three betas. One in here. One in the other tanks and stuff. And this basically stayed the same. I still use this, which at first I did not recommend, but now I highly recommend it because it really helped my tank. And I'm getting more fish soon. I'm saving up for some glow fish. Yeah, down here I just have like my own stuff. Like I have candles and stuff, but I do have some fish nets and a breeder tank back there. So yeah, that is everything. Those are my updates for now. I do have more updates on things like the lizard. some too exciting news that probably won't happen until about a year but that's going to be in a whole nother video and as you can see the heater is on right now and it's still heating up my tank and right now it's at i don't know if you can see but it is at 78 degrees and then here's the night but yeah i gotta clean up back here it's really nasty so yeah i hope you guys enjoy that update and i will see you in my next video bye